Hey everyone, Dr. Nussi here again, and today we are talking about sparkling ice drink, and we are gonna determine is it healthy, does it fit into a keto or low carb program, and how does it actually taste? That's up next. All right, so today we are talking about sparkling ice drink. Uh, this is a zero sugar product, and I've got the orange mango flavor. When I went to the grocery store to pick this up, um, sparkling ice had four different shelves. They've got every flavor you could imagine. Orange mango seemed like something that I would enjoy, so that's the one that I picked out, but they have a ton of these. So what we need to determine is three things. Is this a healthy product? Is this something that would fit into a low carb or a keto program? And how does it taste? Is it a useful product? There's no point in something being low carb or healthy if it doesn't taste good and you're not gonna to wanna to use it. All right, so this was actually a suggestion on a comment of another one of my videos. So if you have a suggestion for something you want me to review or a video topic, please leave that in the comments section below. I do read those comments, I respond to those comments, and I actually do videos based on those comments. So let's look at sparkling ice and to determine if it's healthy and if it's low carb, let's look at the nutrition label. So if we look at the label here, and it's a little difficult to read uh, just because the bottle is a little curved and th there's a little glare here, but you can see there's 1% juice in this product, which we're not all that concerned with. The five calories includes the whole bottle. The serving size is the whole bottle. There is no fat, so the fat grams are listed at zero. We wouldn't expect there to be fat in a product like this. And also, the carbohydrates are listed at zero. So, where do the five calories come from? Well, it probably comes from that little bit of juice. Again, if you've watched any of my other videos, uh, companies, food companies, can list carbohydrates, for instance, at zero, as long as there's less than one gram of carbohydrates per serving. So there's probably less than a gram in this entire bottle, but it still can make up five calories. Okay, let's look at the ingredients to determine if there's any ingredients we want to avoid. So the ingredients, carbonated water, again, a little tricky to read, citric acid, we're good with that, orange juice, no problem, natural flavors, and vegetable juice, again, it says there's a little bit of juice in this product. Let's skip on down. Here's where it's going to get tricky. Sucralose, sucralose is in the ingredient list. So again, for anybody that has seen any of my uh, previous videos, I don't like artificial uh, flavors or sweeteners in uh, different products, especially drink products. I don't like artificial sweeteners in drink products. There's a lot of research uh, that says that they promote weight gain, that they're tied into things like headaches and different kind of symptoms, even things like mood disorders. So primary number one, is this keto or low carb? Yes, this would fit into a keto or low carb program, no problem. Is it healthy? No, I would never recommend something, a drink product, let's say, with artificial sweeteners, just because of how much research there is uh, about things like sucralose, uh, aspartame, and again, how they tie into these different symptoms and especially weight gain. So this would not be a healthy product. This would not be something that I recommend, but it is keto friendly. Now, I did open it and take a drink just to, because I've never had this product before, and it tastes pretty good. It tastes like orange mango. So. This could be a product you would use if you're doing keto or low carb, but again, you wanna look out for artificial sweeteners, sucralose, aspartame, and things like that. Okay, so I hope this was useful. Uh, again, leave me a comment in the comment section below if you have a suggestion for a is it healthy video, and until next time, stay happy and stay healthy, and I'll catch everyone in the next video.